Good morning. It is a pleasure for me to address you in this important activity. Unfortunately, due to previous commitment, it is impossible for me to be with you in person. Today, you are here to discuss plain packaging of tobacco products, a key element as part of a comprehensive approach to tobacco control. Plain packaging is consistent with the demand reduction measures articulated in the WHO Framework Convention on Tobacco Control, and it builds on Article 11 on packaging and labeling of tobacco products, and Article 13 on tobacco advertising, promotion, and sponsorship bans. The guidelines for implementation of Article 11 call parties to consider plain packaging as a way to increase the noticeability and effectiveness of the health warnings and to avoid the use of the package design technique that may suggest that some products are less harmful than others. The guidelines for implementation of Article 13 recognize that the use of the package as a means of advertisement and promotion can be eliminated by requiring, requiring plan packaging. With advertising promotion and sponsorship bans becoming more common, the package becomes even more important, which is why the industry fights so hard to prevent plain packaging laws and regulations. Tobacco companies know there is a growing body of evidence that proves plain packaging works in lowering tobacco use prevalence when it's part of a comprehensive tobacco control policy. And that is the reason why the industry will be making many unsubstantiated claims about the alleged negative effects of plain packaging in your country. But the strong evidence from countries that have already implemented plain packaging refutes industry claims and instead underscores the importance of plain packaging. The number of countries implementing plain packaging continues to rise, now being over 20 countries from various regions and stages of economic development, including Saudi Arabia from the Eastern Mediterranean region. Meanwhile, the industry's attempts to hold this progress are visibly failing. One recent but important example of such failure was the 2020 World Trade Organization, WTO, appellate body ruling confirming the 2018 panel decision that plain packaging is fully in line with WTO law, a clear victory for global public health. You will learn much from the experience of other parties over the course of the next few days, as well as how you can expect the tobacco industry to react and how you can use the evidence to respond. I encourage you to press forward with plain packaging and to approach us and WHO if you need help. I hope that the new few days will help you move forward with this important public health measure. Thank you.